Um, before I speak to you mothers, we have a few announcements here. First, first, this lovely guy who just spoke to us, his birthday is next Tuesday. So, happy birthday, Mike. Yeah. Next Sunday, um, you see these guys behind me that have been here forever. They're our family. They've been here for years. The one that's trying to run away from me right now, John, next Sunday is his birthday. Yeah. I'm mentioning it now because he won't be here next Sunday, so we have to... <laughs> okay. Now, um, something else on, on a very different note. Uh, does anybody here remember a guy named Donnell? He had uh, light green eyes. Do you remember Donnell? He has passed away. He has passed away, and um, there's his girlfriend's over here. They had a little memorial already. They had one up in L.A. Um, he just he made his birthday, but he passed away on uh, April 23rd. So for those who... February 23rd. Oh, so it was a while ago. Oh, okay. February 23rd. For those who did know him, um, there she's over there. You can um, give your condolences. It was um, a big loss for her, and she would sure love your support and your hugs right now for those who did remember the nail. And um, last but certainly not least, mommies. Where are the mommies? Where are the mommies? Raise your hand. Mommies. Mommies. Oh, mommy, this is so great. I was uh, driving over here um, this morning from the desert, as I usually do, and I was thinking, what an amazing blessing that God entrusts us with souls, with lives, that we can, us moms, we can give birth, and dads too, I'm not going to knock you out of this, but that we literally carry this life, this soul with us, for those months, and then we are responsible and trusted in these lives to help them grow. And as Mike said earlier, it's a great way, it's a great way to get away from ourselves and to think about others. As moms, how many moms have you worried about your child? How many moms have you just, you just care so much you would rather take the pain away from the child and take it yourself? And this is what the Lord wants us to do with everybody. Love one another. It's, it's a lot easier when it's your own child, but he would like us to take it another step further. Love one another. And not think about ourselves so eloquently that Mike said, just get away from ourselves. It literally is a vacation when you're not so self-absorbed and you can think about others. But moms... We honor you. We love you. It takes a special heart, a special heart to care for our little ones and each stage of life as my youngest one here, almost 34, and just seeing the journey with my son. If, if, if my life didn't have my children, I, don't, I wouldn't be the same person. So it's truly a blessing. And uh, I just want to thank the Lord. Thank you, Lord, so much for allowing us to be mothers and dads, just allowing us to experience this wonderful journey with these lives that, that you have given to us, you've entrusted with us. And we thank you so much for this amazing position you have given us, this honor. We thank you, Lord, for moms and dads, but we especially thank you, our Father God in heaven, Lord Jesus and Holy Spirit. Thank you. Amen.